Hey guys, this is Sanjeevit with another tutorial whether how we can import and export our customers list from QuickBooks Desktop. Well, it's a good thing if the customers list is growing, but adding them all manually will take a lot of time. Instead, it's a good idea to add them by importing using another program like Excel or CSV files etc. It will add all the customers at once and will save a lot of time. Anyhow, to import customers list in QuickBooks, go to the customer center and click on Excel drop down and select import from Excel. You can select the paste from Excel option too. Both of these options will take us the same place and then click on yes. Here is the customer we have added earlier. Anyhow, by clicking on the view field drop down, you can select whether what list of customers do you want to view. On the other hand, in the list drop down field, you can select whether what list do you want to import. At this point in time, I am going to import customers list, that's why I am not going to change it. And if you already have a big list of customers, you can find one by writing his name in the find field. Or you can click on this icon for some advanced search. Anyhow, here is the customers list that I want to import. And on the Excel file, I have fewer columns than the ones I see on the Add Edit Multiple List Entries window on QuickBooks. Well, by clicking on this Customize Column button, we can either add or remove columns we don't need. So that we can match the columns of this window with the Excel file we have. Now I'm removing the ones I don't need. And adding the ones I need, which is customer type. Moreover, we can position a column by moving up and down. Now the required columns have been matched and we can conveniently import our customers list. Now just copy the concerned column data from your Excel file and paste it to the Add Edit Multiple List Entries window on QuickBooks. Now select your customer type one by one and if all the customer type is same, then just right click and select copy down. It will copy down that customer type to all. Now just check your data if you need to make even more changes and for the sake of example, I am duplicating one record. And then click on save changes. Now it's informing that 8 customers record have been successfully added and found one with some issue which need to be taken care of before adding. And when you look at the bottom, the QuickBooks is letting you know whether what issue it has found with this record. So since it was a duplicated record, we can delete it instead of making any change and adding it to the list. Then just click on save changes and select active customers on the view field and then close the window. And here we have a nicely populated list of customers imported to the QuickBooks. Well, let's say we already have a huge customers list in QuickBooks desktop which we want to export. So to export the customers list, just select export customers list under the Excel drop down. It will open a small pop-up window where you will have four different options to select from to export the customer's list. The first one is by creating a new worksheet, which means the list will be exported by creating a new workbook. The second one is by updating the existing worksheet, which means you will select your worksheet and update it with the customer's list. The third one is by replacing the existing worksheet, and exactly the same way, you will select your worksheet, then replace it with the new customer's list. And the last option is to export the list by creating a CSV file. 
Well, I'm selecting the first option which is exporting the customer's list by creating a new worksheet and then click on export. It will take a few seconds to export the customer's list. And here you can see that the customer's list has been exported and we can just save the file. And since it's a macro enabled workbook, we can just save it by allowing it to save it as macro free workbook. And here is the customer's list we have just exported. And I hope this will be helpful for someone out there and thanks for watching.